Yeah, Jory, Jalen Ferguson didn't get a chance to go through these drills at the NFL Combine, so this was his only shot to impress NFL scouts, and he did exactly that. 24 reps in the bench press, had a 32-inch vertical, ran in the 4.7s in the 40, and showed out during the positional drills. Safe to say, Jalen probably made a good amount of money today. I feel like I was solidifying myself today. Now I opened a lot of eyes up to see me today. I talked to a lot of coaches. All of these one team to fall in love with me. So that's my goal right now, find me one team to fall in love with me, get on the best word that I can give them. There's a lot riding on this day for him, and so he seemed a little tight early, but when he went to position drills, then that's where he really started to shine, and ultimately that's they're, they're not going to a track meet or do a combine. They're looking for football players, and I think that's one of the things that makes Jalen so good is how productive he is on the field. So it was nice to see him kind of finally loosen up a little bit and then go and go play the game the way that he can play it. Now, Louisiana Tech not the only school going through their pro days today. Grambling had their workouts this morning, and Tim Owens was with the Tigers. Tim? Yeah, Brad, roughly half the NFL teams represented here at GSU's Pro Day today. One of the guys that caught the scout's eyes, Devon Lindsay, the wide receiver. He ran a 4-4 40-yard dash, and he just looks the part. But the guy who stole the show today, Marco Rosco, the kicker. He was booming in 50-yard field goals over and over again, and the scouts, they were taking notice. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I, I knew I had to come out here and give it all my all. This was the day for me, man. I, I've been training for this this these past couple, six, seven weeks, man, and I knew I had to come out here and impress, man. This was this was it for me. So this is a very special day for me. I knew I had to come out here and impress, and I knew I'd, I'd pop a lot of eyes and turn some heads. He's a very reliable guy. Uh, he can he can definitely place the ball where you want it placed on kickoffs. He can sky kick. Uh, he can also punt as well, uh, as well as kick field goals. So uh, he'll definitely be a guy that I think will be a hot commodity, you know, for the next level. And that wraps up the Pro Day festivities over here in Lincoln Parish. But tomorrow morning, Northwestern State holding their Pro Day. We get to see if Jazz Ferguson can build on that great combine performance. Reporting at Grambling, Tim Owens.